the open closed principle for Java. So with our open closed principle, we want something like we have a graphics class that pretty much draws things on the screen. So you want to draw a circle and you want to draw a rectangle. Well, those both things are drawing something to the screen. So why not bridge that into one class and then just having a shape class that you can turn into a rectangle or circle or, or anything with the shape class and just have one method. That is the open close principle. You shouldn't be creating methods for special cases. You should create one method that does drawing to the screen, but you have methods, you have classes, I mean, that do, that draw to the screen differently. You should do that with classes. Um, that kind of does that here, but it should only be one class. So, so like, a circle and a rectangle, what they have in common, they are shapes. So, um, so if you have, I'm trying to figure out an example here, but um, if you have a person running, and you have a um, uh, find out how how many how many calories a person is doing per step, you don't put like a, a um, uh, calc step, uh, um, a calories burned in an hour, and then put one for a kid and one for an adult. You put it as a person class or a, an exercise class, and then you put in their age in there to um, depict what it is with their ages, you don't have like, a kid version of the method, you don't have an adult version of the method, you let the class decide if it's a kid or a adult. So, making, so to make this better, you should make the circle and rectangle one um, class, and that should be shape. This is how it should be. According to this principle, you should have the graphics class, you should have one method called shape draw, which is which is called shape dot draw, kind of an interface called shape, implement shape, and then you have your different um, classes that have shape, and you're all done. I mean, you just do shape circle equals new circle, and then you just put it in there, and you're all done. And this makes this a lot cleaner. So if you look at shape. I mean, what is a shape, circle, rectangle, you just put that in. It's just a lot cleaner than using special cases, and this will be a lot... This will make more sense for you to do for a lot bigger things. For example, you have a database and you're trying to query things. Make one query method that just has a um, string of your query and then just query something and it gives you the cursor for example instead of just having a special case for every single query you'd have you know you know over a hundred methods just querying why not just have one query class that does everything have a custom query class that holds all your strings of queries for example and that's it open closed principle makes everything your classes a lot neater and cleaner I'd recommend it. I use it. And that's it.